We'll just go. Well, today okay. we're going vertical because I I did it wrong. Okay. Well, hi everybody. I'm the chief market analyst here at ITM Trading. And today I'm just going to update you on some things and then talk about two very important things. Now there is discussion of lopping off zeros on the Indonesian currency. That's because they say they want to simplify it. Well, I don't know. If they talk to the people in uh, Venezuela or in India, I don't think changing the currency and demonetizing it made it any simpler. But okay. Another thing that's kind of interesting in here that, you know, we are... We've been trying, the Dow has been trying to break 20,000 all week and it hasn't done it yet. But I was listening to CNBC this morning and specifically Bob Pisani, which is where this article is from. And the number one reason why you see the Dow breaking or near breaking 2000 is with the central bank help. So we know that this is artificial. And the markets are now rallying on the greater fool theory, which means that they are counting on somebody even dumber to be willing to pay even more for severely overvalued stocks. If you have your wealth in there, say thank you very much like the insiders are doing and sell out. Do what the smartest guys in the room are doing for themselves, not what they are telling you to do. Okay, now we're going to get to the really important stuff. And we are really starting to see a big break in the pension plans. Uh, I think last week, or I think it was last week, where we told you that the Dallas pension plans were withdrawals were halted. Okay, now we have notification from CalPERS that they have, uh, that they have cut benefits to those people that are already getting benefits plus future benefits by 60%. Because all of these pension plans, whether they're state, federal, or corporate, are severely underfunded. So if this is what you're counting on to retire, you might want to rethink that choice because the veneer is now cracking really noticeably. And remember, too, I'm going to have to read this. They, Calper says that they are only 65% or they only have 65% of the funds that they need to pay out the benefits that they're required to. And they also have set everything up anticipating that they would get 7.5% return on their investments. So they've lowered it now to 7%. But here's the thing. You've got government bonds that are issuing, that are yielding less than 3%. So you tell me, unless they're the manipulated markets, where are you going to get 7% return? That means that these funds are even more severely underfunded than what they report. So remember, we did a, a full webinar on the retirement plan time bomb in the archives. Go see it if you haven't yet. And then here's the big one, though, because this could certainly trigger an interest rate derivative event where you have Banco Monte de Pesci, which is the oldest bank in the world, that really first they're going to do a bail-in. So you depositors, those that have bought those bonds, they don't understand what they're buying because nobody reads the contracts. They will be bailed in. But that isn't nearly enough to save this bank. So they are also now stepping in and bailing them out. And my personal opinion is that this is what we will see more and more and more. Yeah, depositors will be bailed in first, then taxpayers will do the bailing out. But when the interest rates spike to such a level, they cannot be bailed in or bailed out because remember, 82% of the derivatives of 1.7 quadrillion global derivatives, and that's notional value, are interest rate related. And the more that this kind of thing happens, the higher interest rates are likely to go once they lose full control of these markets. And that's coming. So, hope you have great holidays. I know this wasn't great news, but 
like us on Facebook and subscribe. And we'll let you know the next time that we're doing it. Check out our YouTube channel and give us a call, 888-696-4653. We are here to be of service. Ho, 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 everybody. Bye-bye.